What is going on YouTube? It is Etown99. Uh, hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. So uh, today I'm going to be building the Ultimate Tonda S2000 CR Edition. Um, I don't know. I just I I, I don't know. I saw one of these the other day and I was like, it'd be really cool to have like a twin turbo V8 Honda S2K or you know, the equivalent of what um, Forza will let you do. Um, yeah. So I th I thought this would be kind of cool. So let's let's uh let's just do this shit. Um, really hate pretty much all of those. I wonder if there's a body kit for this car in this game. This is one of the only cars I'm ever gonna get in black. By the way, um, I don't know. I just don't like black cars very much. Let's, except an Escalade. I just thought a matte black Escalade or a matte black Lamborghini Aventador would look pretty cool. But, uh, I'm not always the biggest fan, but I don't, it kind of fits. I know a guy with a black S2000 that looks really, really good. Uh, but he's got carbon fiber bits all over it. It looks really fucking good. So there's no body kit version, engine swap, Turbo Rally V8. 6.2 liter V8. Keep it rear wheel drive for the funds. Twin turbo, so exactly what I wanted to do to this car, it has. That was insane. Uh, that's actually about what my buddy's S2K looks like. He just doesn't have the canards on there. And the CR wing looks way better. And if I was ever going to have one, I'd definitely put the hardtop on too. Uh, I kind of hate convertibles. I run one for the first time the other day. It's, it's interesting. It's fast. Mm, don't think I'd ever buy one though. That looks quite good. So I was kind of shooting for a thousand horsepower because it seems like it'd be pretty insane. So we got 1,016 horsepower. It's pretty fucking a lot. <laughs> so I don't, I don't ever really remember driving one of these in this game or any Fords are really. So um, this is going to be uh, quite, quite the thing to try, I guess. <laughs> Let's get it. Hey, Zach. I've identified another potential recruit for your lineup. Welcome back, Zach. There's an ongoing championship that you're taking part in. Would you like me to set a route to the next race event for you? Let's... Ooh, I have a lot of things. I haven't played this game in a while. Rivals. No thanks. Let's see, what, let's, see what, let's see what we got. Huh. Let's uh, let's work on more of these, cause um, what is this? Oh, this oh, that's not what I want. This is what I want. Lamborghini Gallardo LP 570-4 Super Leggera. Still though, I would like to work on these. I want to get all of them, and I want to do that one race that takes like three hours again. I got a shit ton of money from that, and I'm running slowly, slowly running out of money. And I just put a car up. I oh, I want a Dodge Viper ACR Horizon Edition, the day and wheel spin. I think that video is coming soon. And, uh, I, I really hated that car. I bought one and I absolutely hated it. So, I just threw a quick paint job on it. Very good touch and film it. Awesome. So, hopefully, I get some money from that. It's not, I mean, first impressions, it's not bad. It's actually pretty cool. Stock tune, it's pretty good. I don't know how fast it's gonna be. It's 
very slippery. I and mean, that's what I kind of expected from a thousand horsepower car that weighs like nothing. You have arrived at your destination. Let's go find this new driver that I keep hollering at me about. I'm over here. I haven't been here yet. Let's go here. I have not been to this stupid thing yet. It keeps telling me whenever I am not recording it and I'm playing, it says it on the radio. Like, you guys gotta get out of here or some shit. So, I don't know. Let's go check it out. After, I haven't been here yet, so let's check it. Let's go to the car meet. See, I haven't even been to the airfield yet. Looks fairly like an airfield I've been to before. There's that guy I'm looking for right here. Race this pool, then I guess. Oh, oh, that was solid. What kind of car is that? Is that a Lexus? I think it is. Oh god, that thing screwed me over. It's just not a, it's not a race car. I'll give that. that Lexus IS 2150? Oh, F. Whatever. Same fucking thing. No thanks. Actually, I don't even know who's on my team anymore. I haven't done one of these things in forever. I believe Slap Train's on it. Like, the first time this game came out, I played all night. And I got Slap Train, like the first guy. Let's, uh, let's check it out, though. See who I got. I definitely do not want this kid on here. I got Jack the Ultra Gamer, Slap Train, Beetle Comet, and No Comply. I don't know who that is. I have no thanks. God, Jack, how is he such a high level? He has 154 million credits. Oh, it's Lifetime. Slap Train only got 56. Yes, 100% reject that kid. Let's go back to this comic though. It does have one problem. Is that cocaine? It does have one problem this car though. Its gears are quite short. It is like a rag car. I'm not gonna... Oh, I, I made it. I saw it. This is the car meet. People showing off custom paint jobs, people swapping tuning tips, people drag racing on the airstrip dirt. Horizon is about people too, you know. Lovely car mad people. The pre-order car. What's the difference? You just you got it? As soon as the game came out, and Shelby. The BAC mono. Hmm. Okay, so it's exactly the same. As before, can you swap cars? Oh, you can. Okay, that's good. Um, it doesn't seem like uh, can you race? It, I mean, the bitch said you could race him, but 
matchmaking and loading. Okay, well this was a complete waste of time. this thing. It's not entirely great. Oh. And this is seems like a car you'd straight race, so let's uh oh god I'm so far away from everything. Um let's see if I can make it so that it drives forward not spin as much okay so since I have no idea how to tune for street racing I'm going to use the Forza Tune 6 app I don't know how well it's going I don't know like the differences between Forza Motorsport 6 and Horizon 3 if there are any but they did add some new options as such as off-road drag dri and drifting I think drifting was in there but the drag and the off-road I believe were not in there before Horizon 3 so um, I'm just gonna try this and see how it does so Okay, so if you guys have the exact same setup as I do, with a thousand horsepower and the max out tires and everything, this is the tune Forza Tune 6. Um, so this would be the best for racing like I'm going to be doing. So, 27 PSI in the front and the rear. The gearing I'm going to do in a second. There's the alignment, the roll bars, the springs, uh, the dampening, the arrows, just whatever, brake, and the diff. So next I'm going to do the gearing. Or it, there's another, you have to do another thing on here, so I'm gonna do that real quick. Okay, so, um, this gearing's odd for me, but you know, I've never really tuned a car to street race. Um, before so oh it went up 20 miles an hour okay that's that's pretty good it also brought down the 0 to 60 time which is also really good it's, it's I mean it's better I guess feels like really really soft something I usually don't like I usually like the cars super stiff that's what she said <laughs> and still I mean that's such a low number let's race this guy and see how it does I'm gonna tweak this tune a little bit just from what I know about tuning, which is not much for anything other than drifting. That's usually how you do it. It seems like it spins less actually after that. Let's, let's see what we get after these street races. I don't, know, I don't street race very much. 
This one's good. You have arrived at your destination. I don't think I've actually ever done a street race. Maybe once or twice. I don't know. God. Jesus, this is one hell of a fucking street race. A racing Z06 Corvette. Fucking Lamborghini Aventador. A Lycan Hypersport. An Ultima GTR. Or GT. I may have have too little of a car here. When's your SV number? This car's top speed is like that Aventador's fifth gear. Oh god, I I really messed up there. This car is way better than stock though. I I should have messed with the suspension a little more. I don't like how loose it is. That's what she said. <laughs> I do like messing with the brakes though. That's kind of nice because you can kind of get on it really hard and not like just lock them up. Oh my god, this car is just no way. I do not recommend this car. For street racing, or racing in, in any form. I think I'm gonna retry this race with traction control. It is all over the place without it. Still, I can't get over this, this, these gears. I mean, I'm doing, I mean, I did quit at 50% last time. I, I'll give it that, but I'm in fifth place. Are you kidding me? The one tree I hit. It doesn't, it doesn't have the highest speed, which is a major disadvantage against these cars. Like it pretty much just goes to 6700 every gear shift. So if you want a really slow, good handling car, buy the Honda S2000 CR. And for that shit, good lord. Well, I love it up, so we gotta do this spin, right? The F12 Bernalera. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Are you for really? Come on. Oh my god. Alrighty guys, so that's gonna do for the video today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and comment down below what else I should do in this game, other cars I should try, or uh, maybe some cool ideas for builds and stuff like that. So, um,. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, and keep burning rubber. I, I just remembered I kind of made it so it wouldn't burn rubber, huh? Whatever. That was pretty solid for that much. Alright, peace out. Hey, that was pretty good.